Nova. Everybody give it up. Smallsies. Celebrity Small Talk Podcast. Ladies and gentlemen, hi, my name's Idris Elba. I am an echidna warrior. He's one of Hollywood's biggest stars with an extraordinary career in film and television that spans more than 20 years. You're unskilled, untrained, unworthy. Here is Idris Elba! Idris, hey mate. Hi Ken, how are you? Yeah, good. Or you can call me Small Z, whatever. Or you can call me Neighbor, uh, because I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, last year when you were in Australia, were you in Hunter's Hill? That's what everyone... Was, I was, yeah. And so am I. That's where I am right now. That's what every. You were the hot talk of the town, sir. You were the hot talk of the town. Oh, really? Yeah. Walking around in my flip-flops. That's yeah, very Absolutely. Hot, yeah. Just <laughs> blending in, looking like one of the locals. Um, how are you, mate? Thank you for chatting. Congrats on the new movie. Thanks, man. I'm good. Thank you for asking. Uh, really excited for a while to see this film. And uh, yeah, what can I say, you know? I do miss Australia, though. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, really? Whereabouts? Do, whereabouts in the world are you at the moment? I, I, New York, London. I'm in London at the moment, um, and um, and uh, yeah, and then you know the premiere for the film is next week in LA, so I'll be heading over there soon. Oh, nice. Well, um, Australia has not changed. It's exactly the same as it all, except it just seems to <laughs> rain more now. I'm not sure. Maybe you bought the weather with you, but it just has not stopped raining in months. Um, I, cool. wanted, I wanted to ask about the movie. When you when you sign up to do uh, an, an animated film, whereabouts on the uh, rolling out of bed, just rolling into work uh, scale is it? Do you, do you put, cl- no, I was going to say, do you put clothes on? Of course you put clothes on. But do you have to worry about like what goes into what you're looking like as you're rolling onto set? Or are you like, it's a tracky dax kind of situation. It, it is. It is comfortable. It's you know when you when you walk into the studio, you're going to be in there for at least four hours, right? So you just want to be comfortable. Uh, slippers. I do a lot of my voices in my slippers. Probably the same slippers that I was walking around Hunter's Hill while doing Sonic. Um, but I, <laughs> I definitely like to be nice and comfortable. Lots of hydration. Lots of water. Mm-hmm. Uh, and that's water. Yes, oh, oh, absolutely. I was going to say, uh, if they're filming a, a sneaky behind the scenes or something like that for the DVD, then you'll put like probably proper shoes on. But if there's no filming, you're just a man in slippers. Uh, are they fluffy? What are you? What sort of slipper man are you? I'm a more a sort of like, uh, you know, like a flip floppy slipper. Sorry, my phone's going. No. A flip floppy slipper. So you know. Toes out. Okay. Yeah, no. Not a closed in Super sort of shoe. Not like a up to your knee sort of big like UGG boot we would call them here. Not that sort of thing too much. No, 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 no. And plus, you know, I move about a bit. So when I'm doing voiceover work, because, you know, you've got to get animated. You yeah, know, yeah. Even though you're never going to be seen, you just want to make your body move like the character's moving. So it's important that my foot- footwear matches that ambition. Um. Now, uh, you have two kids. Uh, I'm guessing the older the older daughter probably not her cup of tea loves your dad but not really into it. Uh, but your son is this is like well in his wheelhouse. Has he seen the movie? Uh, is he a harsh critic? Has he given you any feedback? Yeah, I've got I've got three kids, but yeah, my youngest. Son I have three. Whoopsie days. Uh, I forgot. I forgot the third one. That's awkward. That's bad research. That's I apologize. He's, I apolo- he's I, way older. Okay. <laughs> Um, no, my son has watched pretty much all the films that I've done voices on. Um, you know, uh, he likes to mimic them. Um, Sher Khan was one that he yeah, liked yeah. to mimic quite a bit. Uh, and Finding Dory. But it's good that, um, you know, my son is of that age that I can sort of contribute to yeah. His, you know, the, the, his falling in love with films and well, he's that, his go, old man's voice. Absolutely. I'm being wrapped up, but I was going to say, one day he will resent you. At the point in time where he is now, he loves you. You're his hero. That's fant- <laughs> that's fantastic. <laughs> hey, um, well, uh, neighbour, pleasure to see you again. You're welcome back in you the neighbourhood. Uh, the neighbourhood watch says you are welcome back anytime. Um, oh, and good. we can't have you. Wake up, can't wait to have you back in Australia. And congrats on the movie. I can't wait as well, man. Thanks for that as well. Say hi to everyone I at will. the uh, local supermarket. In, indeed, I will. Good on you, mate. Thank you for the time. Cheers, mate. You've been listening to Smallsy Celebrity Small Talk. Yes. Follow Smallsy on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Or listen live to Smallsy Surgery weeknights from seven on Nova. Nova.